Put this thing on. Oh, get put it is. Hello, everyone, and I am Lee Charles Foxy, back with another episode of Super Mario Maker. Oh, 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 oh get the camera focus. The camera is annoying. Alright, let's uh, focus. Oh, crap, just stop falling over. There, it should be focused now. Focused enough. Yeah, it is. I'm back with Super Mario Maker. Playing some more of my Cuphead Super World. You may remember last episode I did. On this. Uh, I failed on Funhouse Frazzle. But actually, I didn't technically fail. My recording software just died. It just died in. Oh crap. Uh. Okay, wait. I already failed at cheesing this. Okay, I was just gonna cheese it, but I already failed. Okay, one, one second. I can't see if the, the camera does not like to stay. The it, it it's annoying. This is hard and annoying. We gotta keep it tilted a certain way. Crap! Okay, I need to just... There. This is better. Alright, time to cheese it. No! That bad the bagged! I'm sick. You've seen the level in the last episode, hopefully. I'll just be back after I finish. All right, I'm back. I totally beat the level. Didn't totally didn't cheat. You can see here, I'm at the end of the level. Totally, totally didn't cheat. Totally. No need to be suspicious. It's all good, fam. And I has won. I can't tell if this is too bright, is it? Like, just the lighting's bad. I can't tell if the lighting's good or not. I think the lighting's fine now. Time to fight the final boss of Inquilio to the Grim Matchstick. Go ahead and turn the sound up. And. I don't know how to edit videos, cause I'm just a noob. I'm I'm a Roblox noob. We don't hate. We don't be racist towards Roblox noobs. <laughs> but since I'm a total Roblox noob, I don't know how to edit videos. So, otherwise, I would just edit it in the Cuphead music. Okay, I'm I'm trying to look at the camera, make sure it's angled like properly. The, the everything's good. Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, 
cheated. I can completely cheat the level with the Lockitude Cloud, but I just remembered I have to kill all three of these, so that wouldn't really do much good, as I'd only have one key. <laughs> the, the... I probably only should have put in one or two. No! Oh my god! Well, I just kicked the door. It's okay. Door needs kicked anyways. It's a bad door. Crap! It feels like it's so slippery. Like whenever I just look at this through the camera, it just looks so slippery. Well, like, I'm watching it through the camera, and when I'm looking through the camera, it looks the same, except it looks like I'm slipping off everything, and... <sighs> Mario, these are clouds, not ice. Get with the program. You're supposed to, this is supposed to be a good platformer game. Don't make me go back to Celeste. Actually, never mind. Celeste is a really good game, and I highly recommend it. In fact, I just started another profile earlier today. I'm already at chapter 7. But I got off because I'm, uh, working on something. Not gonna tell you what. But it is something on Mario Maker 2. Oh, that almost hit me. But yeah, it is something for Mario Maker 2. <laughs> it is something I've been working hard on. Actually, oh, I should have used the cloud. I could have easily avoided a lot of the, <laughs> the cloud, especially the jumping. Just look at this. Look at this flurry of fireball. There's nothing I can do. I'm really sorry if the camera, if everything just flying around. I'm, like I said, I'm alone on this. I have no editor, no cameraman, no nothing. Um, 15, what, what do you want me to do? Hire a cameraman? I got like five cents. Need to kill two of them. Crap. There's one. No. How many more hits? Just like the final boss. Or the actual final phase for the game. 
There we go. And I already cheesed it by taking one key from the other. I'm just cheesing all these levels. I don't even care. I made them. I'm allowed to cheese them. I have a free cheese pass. Finally, we can move on to Inkwell IO3. I have one life left. Luckily, when I die, I just get all my lives back. And don't have to restart the entire world because I made the world. So, I get privileges. Okay, no, I actually want to show you something here real quick. Just to show how hard this super world is. It will also because you only get three likes, but just, uh, don't, don't look at that. Don't look at that. That was nothing. And then, don't look at those courses either. Uh, uh, eh, eh, that's for the project um, that you don't need to know about. Okay, you already saw. I'm recreating Super Paper Mario, Mario Maker 2. But look at this. 185 likes, 103, or plays, 103 plays. And these are like the first two levels. Look, the tutorial level, 281 plays. Oh, uh, where is Botan Panic? 282 plays and 42 likes. Now, if I come all the way up to the devil, 28 plays. And all bets are off only has 18, which means more people played this. A bunch of people played this normally instead of actually getting into it through the super world. So the super world is pretty difficult. Uh, yeah. And there's the, actually, you can see there the final, the inkwell hell. Alright, we got three levels. I'm pretty sure, yeah, Perilous Piers, Rugged Ridge, I think. Yeah, Rugged Ridge and Dr. Cow's Robot. So, uh, of course, I gotta showcase them all because, uh, uh, Let's go Perilous Piers first because it's probably the easiest one. It's a lot easier on here than it is in the actual Cuphead game. Oh, crap, just kick the door again. Yeah, <laughs> probably shouldn't have rushed it. I know, I know, I'm dead. See, there aren't even any ninja... Uh, there's like... Two to three ninjas in world three because it's just so hard, especially the fiery frolic. Because oh, I thought I was dead there. I'm well, not really dead, but go lose my mushroom. I don't want that. Oh crap, I forgot about you. You can die. Uh, give me that, please. Move. Don't know if my camera got all that. I wasn't even looking at it. But uh, hopefully it did. Now this is what I did for the part where you gotta like, hit the thing to get the rocks. It's really annoying. Cause you gotta avoid these guys, and just like in the normal one, you gotta avoid the fish, and make sure you hit the thing so you can hit the rocks. That it shoots a pell block, you gotta make sure you grab that and throw it at the thwomp in time, or else you ain't gonna make it. Unless you cheat and spin over it. 
better not do. Let's stare into this pipe. Let's see, what next? That level up there is Calamaria. So, I'm gonna just do Rugged Ridge first. I'll do Dr. Cow's Robot and then Calamaria, because the final phase of Calamaria on this is really hard. I died many times. Crap. On this one, to get this coin in the game, you're supposed to dash, but since you can't do that, you gotta do that. Crap, I forgot about you. Yeah, you can cheat this part. These are supposed to be the giant guy that chases you through here. It's really hard. They don't have parachutes, no. They just run through and destroy everything, so you gotta do this really quick. But you can cheat it by going as far to the side as possible the second you come out of the pipe. I should not have blind jumped that. I got extremely lucky there. If I can go in the pipe, that'd be nice. Thank you. Yes. Uh, my arms hurt. My arms actually hurt. I've been playing so much Mario Maker. And Celeste. <sighs> One up house, give me this. I deserve this. Fastball. Fastball. Change up. Four. No, no, knuckleball. Fastball, fork ball. Oh dang it! I gotta listen to the sound of heater. Knuckle ball. Dang it! I'm confused. And I had one left. No. All right. I'm going Doctor Cow's robot. Even though. Both Calamari and Dr. Cal's robot have a really annoying final phase. And I hate it. Junkyard Jive. Die. Again, you can't give keys to enemies on tracks, which I find very stupid and just ridiculous. And this is what I mean by a very annoying final phase. Because he takes so many hits. And if you get backed into a corner, you're screwed. 
unless you can do that. But luckily, he has a massive hitbox, so... But once you lose the Fire Flower, you're pretty screwed. No! <laughs> I want to cry. Because that was so hard to get through. I was legit two hits away. Like, not even kidding, I was two hits away there. Crap! No! That's a ton of bull crap! That's some straight bull crap right there. Some serious dung. You have just a second to get out of there once he goes in his shell. You think this is annoying? Just wait till you see Calamaria. I literally have one hit left. I get hit, I am dead. No! See what I mean? It's so annoying! Alright, how long have we been recording? 24 minutes. Mmm. I almost hurt right now. I am in a very uncomfortable position. Can, can you die? Die, please.
I'm gonna be really careful this time not to lose my fire flower. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. It, all right. All right. All right. You expect me to buy that bull crap? You expect me to buy that bull crap? All right. All right. You have no idea how long this took. I would never play this level again. You have my word that I shall never play this level again in the history of ever. <laughs> Finally! Hallelujah! <sighs> you have no idea how long that took. You don't know the pain I went through to beat that level. <sighs> All right, time to beat Calamaria. And again, this one is also really annoying. Mainly on the last phase. You know what? Every time I take the Koopa Clown car, it always ends badly in this last phase. That's why this is the worst phase. So this time, I'm just YOLO in it. I'm not taking the clown car. And I'm probably gonna have much better luck. This one blooper will ruin it for me. It, I... I forgot to kill him! Oh my god! And I just died. Here we go again. If I'm being honest, these are harder than the... This and Dr. Cow's robots, by themselves, are harder than the Devil Box fight. Like, not even the one I made. Like, the actual one in Cuphead. And I ain't even exaggerating, you don't know the pain I went through just to beat Dr. Cow. And the pain I went through to upload this level. Every time I just go through there, the Koopa Clown Guard gets hit by a spike. Then a stupid blooper kills me. I took the tiniest bit of spike trying to avoid the blooper. And because of that, I run right into the blooper.
So I'm just gonna stay in the clip of the clown car until you're dead. Crap! No! Don't you dare! I swear this is gonna be the death of me. This one blooper. This could be much easier without it because I can never hit the bloopers anyways. Every time I try I can never seem to hit them. Don't you dare touch those spikes. Did I actually make it? Second try, bro. Okay, you get lost now. <laughs> you are not ruining this for me. I actually beat this second try. That's like world record here. It's so much easier without the clown car than that one. How much time do we have? You know what? We have a bit of time. I think we could go until um, Inkwell Hell. I think we can at least beat the Fright Train on this one. We might have to save Inkwell Hell for another episode. I'm just going to cheese this. Because I want to get through this as quick as possible.